Hello, guys. Uh, thank you for coming here. Uh, I'm, uh, my name is Andrzej Kastrzyk. I, uh, I, uh, my, my romance with Jumla uh, is about uh, five, seven, eight years. Uh, I was started to work with Jumla in uh, 2009 when I should uh, prepare some website for a non-profit organization. After that, in two years, I uh, started uh, to um, uh, do some optimization activity on websites, like, uh, like CEO. Yeah. Something about more. Every, uh, usually, I know, uh, during a week, I w I'm uh, living in Warsaw, where, I, uh, where I'm watching out your money. I'm working uh, in some uh, fi financial institution and, and I am responsible for cryptography. But uh, in my f uh, free time, my hobby is uh, not only hobby is CEO, and uh, it uh, and in this case it helps me some um, uh, IT experience because uh, before that I was uh, working several years as IT administrator. Let's start. Short agenda. Ah, I forgot to change the point name, okay. Uh, I uh, divided my presentation on um, uh, three uh, parts. First, the security of your computer, your, your behavior. The second, the security of Yumland. Third, uh, web server security. And in point four and five, fifth, um, how it is um, influence on, um, on your CSO. CEO on the website position in Google. You know, per, uh, perhaps many of uh, us uh, know uh, such uh, stories, like uh, uh, patches, like uh, uh, software up, up to date. Uh, but I think it, it is uh, good sometimes to remind about this because. Uh, during our daily work, sometimes we forget about uh, software to, to prepare some patches uh, for our operating system, for our uh, programs uh, which we install on our uh, computer. The third point, many of uh, our clients, perhaps not developers, but clients, uh, try to install the software, plugins, components, general components from untrusted uh, sources and uh, it is pretty dangerous. Of course, if we are using uh, Windows uh, operating system, we should use some kind of antivirus software, firewall, and a fifth point, in any case, no administrative privileges. And of course, we can, and then we should encrypt our risk because in case of loss our uh, laptop, our computer, we can lose our data and it is important to have some kind of an encryption. We have uh, open source free software, uh, before it, it was encrypted, uh, currently wearable. Our behavior, as, a, as, as I told, don't work using administrator rights. Don't click a trust release. Uh, at this point, uh, I uh, have to say that uh, last year, 65% uh, infections in the US uh, came from um, user behavior because many of them uh, clicked uh, on some uh, links from untrusted. Uh, uh, services or uh, they uh, open it some kind of attachments uh, which uh, in include uh, some viruses. Uh, don't use Wi-Fi networks without own VPN and don't use uh, USB devices like this as cigarettes because they can be a uh, source of malware or viruses. <laughs> Some example. Last uh, month, last before two weeks, we have uh, some uh, kind of mass infection on the world. 
it was um, malware, uh, WannaCry, uh, who, uh, which, which influenced on uh, several websites and IT systems. We heard about uh, infection in, uh, in the UK, in hospitals, we heard about infection in different countries. Uh, something interesting, in Poland we have only 2% of in all computer inf infections. No, it's not bad. <sighs> Web browser. Huh? It is uh, it is uh, good to know that that is um, a web, web browser. It is something uh, like window, like door between us, like people, our system, uh, our computer, and the rest of the world. And in this case, uh, when we are visiting some website, we we uh, can share some uh, information about our computer, like language of operating system, like, like language of, of uh, software, like version of software, uh, like uh, time zone, IP address, and several different additional information. I gave some links here, these were links from different resources. And uh, it should be uh, it, it is uh, some information for us that, uh, that uh, we uh, don't have to visit different uh, web websites because they uh, can include some kind uh, of uh, additional software which uh, give information from about our computer. Behavior, uh, Human behavior to the uh, infection of your uh, OS operating system of computers. Yeah. Uh, what, what's about? Uh, because if you if you are uh, visiting uh, some uh, infected website, uh, we can um, our system of our, our computer uh, can get uh, some malware with virus or, or, or something like this, and. Uh, it's, it's the reason that that uh, we should uh, uh, patch patch uh, our uh, not only our operating system but other software installed on our computer software too. We should uh, uh, watch out on uh, our um, on the, oh, of uh, used software or, or like FTP client like, like uh, CMS files. Uh, it is good to have uh, some kind of uh, web application firewall, yes. Why? Because our behavior influence on on a website. We can um, our system uh, can can be infected. It's some uh, example, and in as effect, our website will will appears in Google like this on this screen. Useful tools to, uh, to check the website before visiting it. Network plugin for different browsers. It uh, gives us information about uh, different uh, data uh, website, like, uh, like IP address, uh, like story of uh, special uh, specific uh, website and the risk of it. I check it in my, in my uh, web browser, which I don't own. We see it was risk routing no risk. We can visit this website. And uh, additional uh, add on plugin, uh, it is uh, localizer, yes, which recognizes technologies used uh, to build website. Shadow plugin uh, gives us possibility to. Uh, that not only IP address but open ports, uh, different services, sometimes links to different websites, and uh, yeah, we can uh, to protect our operating system. We can not only operating system in computer but uh, uh, our smartphone, our uh, tablet, not anything. We can use uh, different software to block. Block, uh, 
block uh, other uh, advertisement network, or we can uh, save uh, some um, some uh, website addresses in our post file, and it gives us possibility to block the uh, malicious website, uh, other website, and so on. I'm not certain we As we know, we, we should uh, uh, have to uh, have soft, uh, software, uh, you will find software day. Same with extension. Uh, if you uh, prepare a website for your server or for your client, uh, it is uh, good to know that um, the number of extension of installed ex extension on uh, in Joomla should be as as low as possible because it uh, limit some possibility to uh, infect by uh, malware. We should use some kind of application firewall. We have uh, several uh, extensions in Umla directory, and uh, we uh, and we can use um, our um, backup software in, uh, inside CMS, uh, inside Joomla, because, uh, because some hosting company uh, doesn't offer a um, regular backup, or uh, in this case, uh, we um, not always we can expect that uh, we will get a backup which we need in the future. Okay. If you build a website using Joomla, we can use different methods, like uh, install Joomla on local computer using uh, different servers, like Sound, like Jump. We can use uh, web server in hosting company, but it it uh, it is connected with public address. If if we want to uh, hide our uh, website before the uh, world, we can use uh, other domain. For example, if a client uh, 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 wants to use a domain like uh, examplebuilding.com, we can use uh, other domain like, like examplebuilding.dev. And this is domain which is not used in, um, in the world. And uh, when we uh, prepare uh, some um, uh, entry in our host file, like, which uh, uh, will include a domain name and IP address from hosting company, we can use this uh, website for work and to show our client. The third way is to um, is separate environment. It means we can use separate computer or uh, some kind of virtual machine on our uh, own PC. And the fifth uh, way is to using web server on Raspberry Pi. I, I saw, I read about uh, it uh, in uh, different um, commun Joomla communities in the US, in the uh, UK, I think. Yeah, it is a good question. And uh, in every case, you should, uh, you should count cost and you should count your skills and uh, preparation because uh, if you uh, can uh, prepare a Raspberry Pi with web server uh, yourself, it's no problem. It costs only, I don't remember, $50, nothing more. And you can get, get it and uh, show in every place. Yeah. Here I show some example of how uh, can, uh, we made how can uh, we do uh, some kind of backup? This uh, some example. We have uh, uh, m many of cases. Uh, uh, we, our clients are buying uh, the car costing, and uh, you are using. And you have the structure such uh, in, uh, here on graphic. Uh, in this case, separate the folder with uh, mail directory or websites. And we can uh, create our website inside Joomla, inside the administrator of the folder, or we can uh, change some settings, for example, in a backup, and uh, uh, redirect these backups to the folder outside uh, basic um, path. 
for example, you can locate our backup folder in the root folder, in the root uh, hosting folder. We can uh, use uh, some external service like uh, perfect dashboard or, or a watchful. Yeah. But uh, it is good to have uh, not only one place where we have backup, but uh, several places like our computer, like external disk, which can better for, for our current backup. How to pick up hosting company? Short information. We should we should uh, check optimization possibility. Of course, it depends on, on a web server like Apache, and Genix, or like the and uh, we can uh, ask our hosting provider if uh, 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 he uh, gives some kind of web firewall or or. Uh, he was uh, not secure. And it is, I don't know if see if you see it or not. Not so much. Not so much. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I, okay. Yeah. Uh, many of, my, of our clients. Uh, uh, Comes on the cost nothing more, but we should know that uh, we can, uh, uh, we should, we need to uh, choose um, responsible costing companies which uh, gives not only small prices but uh, which gives additional possibility. Uh, here I uh, prepare some, uh, I, I hope, funny picture. It's a, it is an illustration, uh, in this example, for. for one or five person component. Last year, last year, sorry, we have uh, in Poland uh, such a story. Uh, some uh, some guy uh, was reading uh, costing component about ten years. Uh, he uh, hired only one admin. This uh, They cooperated and it was good. But after this time, uh, this after uh, the, the number of increasing servers, the, num the uh, sysadmin uh, protested and uh, expected more money. And they are, and he uh, said uh, goodbye. And in this case, in, uh, this company had no uh, technical service. Uh, owner of this company uh, informed that, that he worked, worked about it, about problems, but all the component looked look like, like, like this, like some flat or apartment and what more. Next question, which we should have for the uh, costing company. Does, uh, this com does costing company use any, uh, not only uh, firewall, but uh, some kind of uh, IDS, intrusion detect system, does uh, hosting company uh, hire uh, skilled people, skilled professionals, yeah. and in the case uh, uh, of our clients, you know, I, I think, I uh, hope that many of you are web developers or uh, some uh, kind of people who have uh, some technical experience, but many of our clients does, uh, don't have such experience and they, uh, they uh, expect, expected from us um, a secure uh, solution to, uh, to uh, care about their website. And in this case, uh, it is better to prepare for them some kind of uh, secure um, FTP, like uh, SSH, not pure FTP. Some, I hope, fresh web server comparison this is from last year from root users and it is important uh, question before we choose some hosting company yeah or 
other possibility would we can use uh, some kind of CPM network to get some uh, picture from uh, Cloudflare, which shows the differences between um, normal plastic and between uh, uh, between costing which uh, between costing which uh, website which uh, using Cloudflare or other CDN network. And it, in this case, we uh, see that uh, we can it is uh, additional protection uh, with, uh, for browsers, uh, bots, attack different attackers. And uh, as I know, Google uh, has. Uh, different uh, plugins for to connect with software with other uh, cloud computer suppliers. How to increase security of our website? First of all, uh, when clients start to uh, build website or when we are as developers wanted to prepare some website for my, uh, ourselves or from our clients, mm -hmm. we can use some kind of uh, email address. In this case, probably it can be uh, Joomla, G uh, it can be <laughs> Gmail address, address uh, email address or uh, other address. And I, uh, I show here how it is important to uh, protect our credentials, it means address, username, password, yeah, because if we uh, lost our password to one service, for example, for uh, G Gmail, we can lose access to our uh, service in hosting component, yeah. In this case, we can use our, some kind of password manager, uh, we can uh, ask ourselves it should be password manager in cloud or local on our computer. Uh, personally, I think that on a local uh, computer it is uh, better chips. Uh, I don't know if it's, it is visible, is it visible or not? Some information about email. If you started to register domain, if you started to buy um, uh, hosting services, if you plan to uh, connect to service uh, to CDN provider, you, yeah, uh, you can use some email as we told before. And uh, every, and I uh, try try to show on this picture uh, all the, these services, because um, in some uh, special cases. Uh, attackers uh, can, sh sh can attack on our web hosting or they uh, can attack only special part of our uh, website. Uh, for example, uh, in, uh, on DNS servers on, or uh, in our CDN provider. I think probably you heard about uh, some uh, kind of attack I, I don't remember exactly. F three, four months ago, uh, Cloudflare uh, clients um, were um, lost uh, their uh, credentials. It was a known story. Yeah. Why we should protect our website, our Joomla? Because there are the possibility to, to lost some data, uh, to lost uh, private data, and uh, we should know that cyber criminals every time are seeking some gaps in our system and our journal. Some people, uh, criminals, use uh, use uh, black hat CEO techniques uh, uh, to infect our website with different links or malware, and it is some information <coughs> links. Some factors. Uh, I didn't want to show all the all the CEO factors here because it, 
Infect these networks in the first step in, and in the second step our our Joomla. And in this case, our, uh, when we try to visit uh, infect the website, we see such information. Okay. Other factors uh, website uh, can be penalized in case of uh, sending uh, some uh, mass mail, some spam and in this case this website uh, can be can uh, be installed on a different uh, web list or in other case when our uh, when server in our custom component is infected can to be uh, in this uh, case this cost can be report, reported to companies, companies who are reading uh, blacklists and our reputation our reputation it means our our website reputation uh, is much more lower and in this case it will penalize our our uh, position in the implements SSL certificate in the right way. Why? Because uh, iPad uh, and I, sometimes iPad uh, some uh, additional work, job uh, because uh, uh, some developers uh, mm, uh, prepare their uh, templates or their components using only pure HTTP not HTTPS if there is such possibility. And in this case, we uh, saw in your uh, in your uh, not only uh, green uh, key, but uh, we uh, see uh, yellow. Yeah, and information this site is unsecure. Why we should we should protect our website? Here more information. Because uh, uh, in case of a building website of, or in uh, case of uh, the preparing website for a client, uh, some of our client don't, clients uh, don't uh, want to pay more for additional protection, like 
back up to like to some kind of firewall, web application firewall, or for our additional job, which uh, is dedicated to secure project or journal website. And in this case, it is uh, good to show our clients that in the future, when uh, uh, site uh, website will be infected, which uh, uh, will uh, have to pay for malware removing for additional website protection. Yeah, without knowing because he offers some, some kind of services like malware removing. Uh, and of course, sometimes for transfer website from hosting A to hosting B to another hosting. Yeah. Or sometimes cyber criminals can encrypt your files in different places on your PC, on your local computer, on your uh, disk, external disk with backups, on your in your uh, uh, journal room, and. Uh, Sometimes on uh, web server directory, web server with many several websites because uh, it was not so secure. Yeah. Why we should protect our website? Because it's something new. Runs, uh, runs over here is uh, some kind of business uh, which is uh, growing all the time. And many of you uh, see uh, some potential to earn money, additional money. Because uh, in the case of uh, encryption of your files, of your website, you can decide pay or not. If you don't pay, okay. But in this case, you have to have some backup. If uh, uh, you don't have a backup, you probably, perhaps, you want to pay or to get some encrypted files, some encrypted website. But you should remember that if you pay, in this case, you support cyber criminals. They have more money to develop their activities. And of course, uh, if you have a working business which is based on Joomla sites, your the position of uh, your websites uh, will be not so higher if your if your website is infected. Yeah. In this case, website your website loss that. Its position in Google. We either wrote in this as we in search engine because uh, we, as we know, uh, we have not only Google. We can use different uh, search engines. Yeah. And in fact, the websites uh, usually are reported not only to Google but uh, to uh, different families, to uh, in uh, different companies. And it is, uh, and here is some tip: uh, if you uh, create uh, some new website on new domain, you can uh, report this website to uh, not only to Google using uh, Google Search Console, but uh, to antivirus companies, which give such possibilities. You can; uh, it is simple. You uh, can uh, write only domain name, nothing more, and some bot from some antivirus company will check your. Uh, how secure is your website? In this case, you are sh uh, you will be sure that uh, website uh, is um, uh, has not uh, uh, malware. And the second, um, uh, your website got additional links. Yeah, it helps us to reach better position in Google. And in case in web infected website, of course, our website lost authority. And if, if uh, you are using your website to make some business, you lose, you will lose money. Yeah. Uh, we 
case uh, if you if your website or client website uh, will touch uh, some kind of malware, uh, probably uh, you will get some kind of mail, some kind of message from Google, which uh, recognize uh, uh, infected websites. But it is here in the second thing. Uh, I was using not only Google as search engine or um, to report new website, but I using different uh, websites. Uh, and six years uh, about six years ago, I reported my website to uh, to uh, Russian search, search engine, and uh, yeah, yes, yes, and uh, it works very good. Uh, I feel better than Google, yeah, and. It depends, yeah. Uh, but uh, uh, it uh, recognizes um, in fact the website quickly, but we then Google. It is useful to, and it is in this case it is useful to report. Our yeah. Costs. We will spend time. Time to in your website. We will spend this, if, uh, some money to. For a professional, I think that on this, in this room many of you are professional and it is, perhaps it is not so good for you to cost such uh, uh, clients, but uh, you can uh, ask clients about additional services. And of course, uh, if you have an infected website on uh, some uh, server and costing, uh, program, probably other websites on this plastic on the virtual server will be infected too because attacker has uh, access to the server. And it is uh, some information from Sukuri about some kind of malware. From my side, that's all. Thank you for patience. Thank you.